All right, friends, how are you today? Aaron here bringing you your daily horoscope for Friday, the 21st of August 2020. We have a pretty cool day in front of us. We have a really cool day in front of us, all right? The sun, last day in the sign of Leo this year, all right? 29th degree of Leo. All right, the 29th degree of Leo tells us that nothing is to be... How do we say this? Everything is to be shared. Everything is to be for everyone. Every concept, if a concept, an idea comes to an individual that is no longer just the property of that one individual, but to be shared with humanity as a whole. Okay. So this is saying, you know, if we're feeling something, if something's going on in our lives, you know, it's, we're not alone. This is not just about us, a solo journey that whatever's happening is to be shared with everybody. Uh, whether that's a brilliant concept, okay, uh, an idea that, that will, you know, lurch uh, or, or um, leap humanity forward, okay, or, or the, that's a feeling, an idea, uh, a, a display of art or, or personal, right, uh, um, freedoms in the way we express ourselves and be, you know. Um, so this is, it's about sharing. This is an unsealed letter. Okay, this is meant to for anyone who passes to open, to be able to read, to be able to extract the knowledge from. All right, and that is the universe. Again, it's something we kind of talked about the other day when something's on the tip of your tongue and it's in the ether, you know, and it's like easily for somebody else to grab that. And this is saying this is great. This is life. This is the exchange of of humanity, you know, from peer to peer, uh, exchanging ideas. And to express ourselves, and when we fully express ourselves and we sing our song, like we've been talking about this week, that, you know, we're going to attract the right crowd to us that resonates with that song or resonates with that idea. Um, and it's a very harmonious feeling. So we just have that courage, right? The pride of the line, the courage, the strength to be able to do our thing, to share, to be ourselves, right? So that's a beautiful aspect. Uh, so last day of the sun in Leo. We're going to have to hold on to this and remember this energy as we move forward through the rest of this year. Um, we've got the moon at the later degrees of Virgo early in the morning. Okay, happy place for the moon to be. Uh, it is going to be around like 5 a.m. when some people are, well, depending where you're at in the world, uh, around 5 a.m. My time um, is the, uh, uh, the trine to Saturn. Okay, um, and we're getting a septile over here to, let me show you. Uh, excuse me, that's happening at like midnight, the, the midnight my time, uh, the moon trying to Saturn, right? Discipline, yes, you know, moving forward, this is all good stuff, okay? Uh, so this septile over here to Mars, okay, which is a fun feeling because the moon is already focused here in the sign of Virgo, okay? And Mercury is in Virgo, uh, creating uh, not only this sextile, down here to the north node, home in Gemini, okay? Easy flow of information. Oh, I'm sorry. That's, ah, I'm out of my element. That's the sun. Uh, sorry, when we move forward today, uh, Mercury is going to make the septile of Venus. That is the connection. Um, and as we continue to move forward, this, the moon is going to enter Libra, and around 7 p.m. here, we're going to create the opposition, okay, to Chiron. And as you see as well, that septile down here to the north node. Okay, so that's our connections going on here. What is what is this energy telling us? What is uh, the septile to Mars saying? Okay, when we're focused on a specific thing, we take this energy and we move forward with it. It's strike while the iron is hot and to not fear making decisions. Okay, this is extremely important. We've come to a crossroad and it's left or right. The Bob Ross expression, I love to say, all right, it's time to make some hard decisions here. We're going to we're going to paint some mountains. We're going to put a tree right here. All right. We're going to, we're going to make a decision that's going to alter the course. So there's a left and the right. Which direction are we going into? Okay. And we're fearlessly, last day of, of the sun in, in, in the pride of Leo, you know, fearlessly moving into a direction. And we're not going to second guess ourselves no matter what. You know, this is the direction. This is the decision. This is the intuition that I'm getting. And I'm not going to second guess myself. Now, if this leads me to... Uh, uh, a path that's uh, dangerous and difficult or whatever to, to get over, that was the decision that I made, and I'm going to stick behind it, and I'm not going to curse saying I should have turned left when I turned right. 
You know, that's not the energy here, right? The story that the planets are telling us today is just like, no, 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 we, we're, we're going to make a decision and we're going to see it through. We're going to follow it through no matter what, as hard as it is going to be. And we're going to learn from that. We're going to be able to extract all the knowledge we need to, you know. Um, uh, and, and this is also saying with, with Chiron opposing the moon here, like, don't be afraid to go alone. Okay. Don't be afraid to step out and, and, and do you, you know, sometimes we're always like, Oh, my friend didn't want to go for a walk in the park with me. So I didn't make that decision to go. All right. And this is saying like, look, follow your own path. If you want to go for a walk, go for a walk. You want to go explore a new trail, go explore a new trail. If you want to go on a new adventure, go on a new adventure. You don't have to have the permission or, or somebody else to do it with. Okay. This is the moon opposing Chiron. All right. My emotional wants over here to be with somebody to be, you know, this is a joint effort and a group, a group effort. Okay. Um, and Chiron's saying, well, yes, but we also need to heal this as, as, you know, these concepts of self or, you know, or if I'm always going alone, going alone, again, there's always both sides of the coin, uh, two ways to look at it and, and all this energy for momentum saying, all right, maybe I'm used to going to the park by myself. Don't be afraid to hit somebody else up and see if they want to tag along. But ultimately the decision, you know, I have to follow my own path here. Hey, look at that specials look, pop up blocker you got to put that on there <laughs> anyway uh, as well as the moon is moving in through libra we're going to get those uh nice septiles up here to saturn uh and 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 that's that's uh you know it's about balance over here balance looking at both sides of the coin a need to really look at the other person um and, and to to take into consideration what's going on in their world, to take into consideration the steps that they've taken or needed to do to get to wherever they are as well. You know, it's like A equals B equals C, and we, we get to sometimes a crossroad, and we can be combative or butt heads or whatnot, but it's just like, well, what steps did this person take? Are we acknowledging, you know, how hard another individual is working, or when something just goes awry, we just, what, you know, you didn't do this. It's like, are we really taking the time to be empathetic? And that's what Venus is saying as well, being empathetic of where someone's coming from or what they're doing or how hard they're working towards something, you know. And we always have a, a you know, egocentrical, a personal, it's a, a personal view on life. You know, um, so it's it's important to have that empathetical that that seeing it from somebody else's perspective today, okay. And and further, not being afraid to make decisions. That is the meat of this day, and and following through with everything. That's the story that it wants to share with us. Not being afraid to make decisions. So if that's, you know, picking up the phone saying come with me, or that's just just saying I'm going out on this solo journey and figuring it out on my own, uh, whatever it is, it's follow through, follow through, follow through. Um, and follow the heart, you know, it's like listening to the voice inside uh, that, that's giving us the inspiration or intuition to pull us in a direction. And that's this beautiful Mercury-Venus connection that's happening right now. So it's like listening to our, listening to our emotions, right, and, and being guided intuitively. All right, my friends, have a beautiful walk, whatever you go, left or right. Sticking with the decision and happy we made those decisions no matter what outcome, right? Pride of the Lions. <laughs> All right. We'll see you tomorrow. Happy Friday.